queen of the stitch, my girl Dane the Dane. Hello there my crafty knitters. Welcome back to the Knitted Oaks channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do the duplicate stitch. Uh, I just did a few little thingies here on this swatch. It's a blank swatch. Um, there's no um, graph paper design that I did before this because this is just, you know, whatever you want to design, okay? This is also a color work technique that is very, very simple. It's a lot less cumbersome than the previous three videos I've done. Um, and it's a quick fix. It's also um, a form of embroidery, so to speak, because... It's something like when I, it's just like you want to add a finishing touch to something that's very plain. This is a plain swatch uh, that I knit just for the purpose of this tutorial. And, you know, just wanted to add a little life to it. You go ahead and you get yourself a different color and then what you've worked with, obviously. And you go ahead and you add little embellishments to uh, the work. You can also use duplicate stitch with beading. Um... I will do a tutorial on that in the future. I've been asked how to do beading into the knitting, so I will do that for you in a future video. But today I'm just going to show you the basic uh, technique of how to do the duplicate stitch. She'll let you pick your color, let you pick your style, and her low, low prices make it worth your while. So hit up the website, stock up your pile, so you can keep your body warm and such a day with a smile.